Hi first graders, I'm going to read the next story in your packet, which is the last story in your packet. It is on page 102, 102. it's called Ribbit by, there it is, Russell Ginns. Ribbit by Russell Ginns. Hmm, I can see that she's thinking about something. Ribbit. Maria was buying a pet. I want a fancy animal, she said. Maria looked at colorful birds and fluffy rabbits. She saw exotic snakes and fancy cats. Oh no, said Maria. The fancy pets cost a lot. I cannot afford them. Maria had only enough money for a frog. The frog had big bulging eyes. It was small and slimy. It was gray and dull. Maria left the store feeling sad. That night, Maria wished for a pet that was fancy or exotic. A colorful pet that would be better than a gray, slimy one. Maria walked back to the store. The frog was still the only pet she could afford. Maria decided to take it home. I will name him Slimy, said Maria. We will have fun. She did not mean it. The frog was not fancy. The frog was not fun. Maria was upset. In the morning, Maria woke up hearing a song. Who was singing, she wondered. It was the frog. Her little frog could sing. All the kids ran to hear Maria's frog. She changed his name to Grayson Thunderlung's Slime Song. She built him a stage. GT Slime Song jumped and flipped and sang. He danced like a butterfly. People came from everywhere to see the famous frog. Maria sold tickets. She was rich. Now I have a lot of money, she said. I can buy any pet I want. Maria walked to the pet store. Maybe I'll get a giraffe, she said to her frog. Then she stopped. You can sing, she said. Your dancing is fancy. You are fun. Maria felt silly. I do not want a giraffe, she said. She kept her little gray frog. That's the end of Ribbit. And this story does not have questions at the end, but it has a page that says draw and write. And so on this page, you can draw your favorite part of this story and label it and write it. Or maybe you can draw your favorite pet. Or if you don't have a pet, the fancy fun pet that you want. That would be cool. And label and uh, write on it. All right. Bye, guys.